Hello everyone, my name is Kibik, and welcome back to another video. I never really know how to do these starter videos. I don't know how professional YouTubers do it. Uh, firstly, uh, one thing that I've been trying to mention is thank you for 100k um, views on all of my videos. Uh, it's pretty cool to see that my channel is growing and I am able to support a lot of people. Um, and especially that those people then if they need help, they, they know that there is a Discord server and that there is people in the Discord server that can help. So that's awesome. So today's video is something that has been widely requested in the Discord server, um, is packing up vehicles or I don't know, I don't know what, you, or what else you want to call it. Essentially when um, combining resources, so instead of having uh, like, for example, to use this. Uh, so instead of having a resource for the Honda Civic and a resource for the Mazda RX-7 and a, not that one, uh, and like for example this Hellfire vehicle, instead of having three different resources which takes up resource space, you can combine them into one big resource. Granted it may take a little bit more time on the load time, um, but in the end, if you optimize the vehicles correctly, which I will cover in another video, um, then you can potentially get um, it all working pretty cool. So I'm sure um, there's gonna be a better way of doing it. I know uh, one of my friends who works as our community support recommended this um, merger but to be honest, I've personally never tried it, so I can't recommend it. Um, I just find my way is a little bit quicker and a little bit easier. Uh, do as you please. So um, essentially my way is creating an FX manifest file, which will search into a particular folder inside of these folders. So what I mean by that is, for example, in the stream folder, we've got arrow ENG, and then inside of that, you've got the the actual vehicle files in there. When you go back to the data folder, again, you've got a similar setup, arrow ENG, and then you've got the car calls. So essentially when the vehicle is loading into the server, it will look for those particular files in that particular resource. And all, all that's changed in this FX manifest file is that we've added some extra stars so that it can uh, be found easier. Again, if you need to download this FX manifest file, it will be available in the Discord server, same as the previous video. Um, I will have both FX manifest files in the video, in the description, uh, in the description, in the Discord. Let's try and get my teeth in correctly. So what we're going to do is we're going to create a pack called YT Pack, just because every every YouTuber seems to name it something after YouTube. In there, we're going to create a stream folder. And then we're going to create a data folder. So these are your primary files. Okay. Now what we're going to do is we're just going to choose a couple of vehicles. So we're going to use this one, for example, uh, let's use I'm trying to look for add on vehicles. Let's use that one, for example, and Sure, we'll, we'll go with those two for now. So what we're going to do is we're going to download them quickly. What on earth is that vehicle? Okay. Uh, so we're going to download these and extract them. Alrighty. So we can close off that one. So in here, uh, we're going to create now, I normally name the vehicles. Oh, they're five and ready. Awesome. Uh, so I normally name them after the vehicle spawn code. That way, when it comes to um, actually like getting it in game, you, if you need to find the spawn code, you just need to look at the actual spawn code. That made no sense whatsoever, but hey. So inside of here, we're gonna create the vehicle file name, and then we're gonna put the vehicle files in here. It does have a mods folder, which are all of the add-ons and extras, which we're also gonna chuck in the stream folder. And then we're gonna go back to the data folder, and we're gonna create another folder, also with the same name, 
We're going to come out of that one and we're going to put all of the data files in there. So essentially what you've done is you, you've now just created a single vehicle resource. Um, but we're going to be, we're going to be adding in multiple vehicles into that resource so that it runs multiple vehicles. So we're going to come out of that a second. Um, I'm not going when uh, I think this one had it or was it this one? Yeah. I'm not going to put in all the audio files. I'm just going to do the basic files. I do actually have another video coming soon that is going to cover, um, audio files into 5M. So do stay tuned for that. So in here, we're going to create another, uh, another folder for this vehicle. So this one's going to be called SG underscore crown 86. And inside of here, we're going to put the vehicle files and then go back to the data file and create another folder in there. Drag and drop. So that's done. Now what we're going to do is that's the wrong link. Now what we're going to do is we're going to head over to my Discord server. So, um, uh, now we're in general, we're going to go to pinned messages and we're going to go to the FX manifest file. Now I'm just going to copy and paste this, uh, just simply because I've already got it downloaded a billion times, but all you need to do is just click on the download button and it will download it for you. But what I'm going to do is just copy and paste it because it's a little bit easier. There we go. Now we need to make a couple of modifications to this. So at the moment, the way that this manifest file is set up is that it will look for files straight inside of here. It won't go into the folders. Now I will already have this pre done. Um, so unless you want to be learning about manifest files, cool. Just listen in. If not, um, just skip ahead 30 seconds or so. So what we're going to do is we are going to put star star and then slash, and we're going to do that onto every single one. Essentially what that's getting the, the, the vehicle to do. Can my phone be quiet? Thank you. Um, essentially what's that doing is it's requesting for it to go into the data file and then star star essentially stands for, oh my Lord, essentially stands for, um, if you, it's going to be looking into any file, any folder with any name. So if you, if you wanted it only to run, for example, this file, but not this one, instead of putting star star, you would just put NK gauntlet. But in this case, we're just going to put star star. So now we're going to save this into the YT pack. I'm going to call it FX manifest Lua. And then that's all done. So what we're now going to do is we are going to start the server and log in and then show, uh, show that both vehicles are in. So I'll be back in one sec. Alrighty, so this is uh, me in uh, editing. I made a bit, made a boo boo. I forgot to ensure it in the uh, server config file, so don't forget to do that. Uh, as you can see me doing now, but uh, yeah, back to the video. Alrighty. Now that we're loading into the server, uh, once we are in, awesome, we are here. So we're going to go back into the vehicles and back in here, 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 here. So we're just going to, I'm just going to move this onto a different screen so I can see it, but we're going to open up the menu, go to vehicle related options, vehicle spawner. Gonna go NK gauntlet four, which I'm sure I'm spelling incorrectly somewhere. 
or pronouncing incorrectly. And there is the vehicle. Which doesn't actually look too bad for, a, for using a GTA stock light bar. Um, and then also you've got the SG Crown 86. Oh, my view menu permissions is doesn't give me access to it. But yeah, so that's the bad of that. Um, so that's just proving that the vehicle works. Uh, probably not the best example to do, but hey. Um, apart from that, any questions, any comments, leave it in the comments section or join the Discord for one-to-one -one support. If you do have any um, video suggestions as well, please let me know. Uh, I'm always looking to try and help you guys out as much as I can. Um, consider subscribing, and that's about it. Woohoo, another video done. See you next time.